I'm beginning to think this Trump guy is not a good for the country because uh, he... <laughs> Um, he's, this rally I was talking about that he did in Waco, he is now playing a song. He's an amazing man. Not only was he the president of the United States and a big TV star and soon to be arrested, but apparently... <laughs> but he is apparently also a pop star because he was bragging, and he's not wrong, he had, for a short period of time, the number one record on the charts. They put out a record with the J6 choir. These are the people on January 6th who are in jail for rioting against the United States government. This is not a joke, and it was number one. Here, have a little listen to what... The... I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. You can see why I went to number one. I mean, that is just... That is some catchy shit, boy. I mean... Woo. Anyway, when a song goes to number one, what does the record company always say? Now we want an album. So... We got an advanced copy. It's called Appetite for Insurrection. Would you like to hear some of the cuts on the album? Uh, it's got songs like, uh, I guess that's why they call it fake news. <laughs> Uh, Janie's got a space laser. <laughs> the kids are all right is a good cut on this album. <laughs> oh, this is a great cut. WAP, white ass patriot. <laughs> uh, rioters delight. <laughs> uh, mamas, don't let your babies grow up to be groomers. <laughs> Midnight Call to Georgia. <laughs> and my favorite, Despot Cheeto. <laughs> I heard it through the microwave. <laughs> and me and Alex Jones, we got a thing going on. <laughs> 